Three months ago, 15-year-old Maria and her two younger brothers, Luca and Tikon, fled Ukraine. Did you understand everything or do you need my help? No, thank you. Like thousands of Ukrainian child refugees, Maria and Luca attend a British school. Theirs is in Kafili. People here, they're so nice and they really care and ready to help. In Ukraine, Maria and her brothers live 200 kilometers from Kyiv with their parents Tatiana and Vitaly, who's a farmer. When Russia invaded, they left everything behind, drove to Poland and eventually applied to come to the UK. They're among more than 77,000 Ukrainians who have settled here so far. Today, I'm joining Maria and Luca as they head off to school. OK, Luca, lead the way. Don't want to be late. Fortunately, it's a short commute. I mean, it's a pretty good walk to school, isn't it? Yeah, I'm for 10 sure. seconds. <laughs> <laughs> Their new home is the former school caretaker's house, which headmaster Lee Jarvis... Morning, Luca. Morning. ...quickly realised was the ideal place to help out with the crisis he was seeing unfold on TV. When we started seeing those pictures on the news, it was, uh, what can we do? How can we help? We had a caretaker's house and we sat down together and thought, well, why don't we use that? We've got a property that we could house a Ukrainian family in if they wanted to come to us. Altogether, there are five children from Ukraine at the school. And to help foster a better understanding among the kids, the school is putting on a meal so the Welsh and Ukrainians can sample each other's dishes. Calendar. 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 Like calendar. Like calendar, but with an O. On the school menu is cowl, cheese tartlets, and of course, Welsh cakes. While Vitali and Tatiana are making the Ukrainian national dish borscht and plov. Wow. You need That's to good. taste it. Yeah. Shall I taste it? Whilst Maria's grateful for the refuge she's found here in Wales, it weighs heavily on her mind that she's one of the lucky ones. My life become really even better here, yeah, have a lot of things which I didn't have in Ukraine and a lot of people in who move doesn't have it. And for me, it's so hard to, uh, to understand and it's like a little bit guilty. What do you mean by feeling guilty? Uh, then I just read the stories and I'm here and I have everything which I need to, but they don't. In the catering classroom, dinner is served. First up, cowl. Is it like famous and do often. We, we have this a lot in winter time when it's cold mm -hmm. outside. Yeah, it, does, yeah. it keeps us warm. Yeah. And nice. yeah. The meal gives the kids a chance to reflect on the short time they've known each other. Megan, what was it like when these guys joined your school? Having someone in my class, it was a completely new experience, but working with Maria and sharing experiences, it really like uh, opened my mind. So Isabel, how did you feel? I loved it, the fact that the school is helping, because I wasn't able to do anything on my own to help. The question is, have you ever tried Ukrainian food? No, I can't wait. It'll be interesting. <laughs> the colour of it, it's, you don't really get that colour from what you have in Wales. No, it's really beautiful, isn't it? Megan, I guess before Maria got here with her family, this was just something you were reading about in the news and mm. seeing on the TV all the time. It was a million world away, but when mm. she moved here, it was like, it's actually a real thing, and I'm living with someone who's been through it, and it's just completely surreal. The food has been truly amazing, but I'm keen to know if Maria's a fan of the local delicacies. Would you eat Welsh food again? Definitely. Would you? You can be honest. Do you actually enjoy the I food? I'm mad about your cakes. Oh, the Welsh cakes. Maria and her family are still so concerned about the situation back at home, but it's great to see the safety and the comfort they found in this school, and also the way they've been welcomed in so warmly by the fantastic community here in Caerphilly.